One of the psychological reasons that we give gifts is that we enjoy the process of developing the idea to give a gift to someone, and of course it's really nice to receive one too. Just like any social behavior, gift giving is governed by norms. So these might be the norms of our culture or of a particular relationship. Research on material versus experiential gifts suggests that experiential gifts actually contribute more strongly to the relationship strength. So they may not be necessarily more liked, but it turns out that experiential gifts really draw a gift giver and a gift recipient together. Recipients of a gift often feel the emotion of gratitude, and in some ways that's one of the rewards of giving a gift to someone. If a gift is overly extravagant or overly costly, what instead people feel is a sense of indebtedness. Maybe the person feels burdened by this extravagant gift and that they have to somehow repay it in the future. So one thing is to ensure that a gift is thoughtful. Research suggests that givers really enjoy giving thoughtful gifts, that is, these recipient-oriented gifts. But there's an interesting twist here. It turns out recipients prefer to receive gifts that reflect the giver instead. So rather than buying something that you think someone will really enjoy, instead, maybe you could give something that reflects your true self, one of your favorite things. Happy holidays and happy gifting.